All right, all right, I am back. So, I do not know what to do here. It's in this room. There's a magical ceiling up there. So, let's go ahead and look through the magical ceiling. Can you see anything? Oh, that is just retarded. That doesn't even make sense. Why wouldn't I be able to see it with the lens of truth? So much so that I'd have to shoot at it without actually seeing it. Doesn't make any sense, people. Using the door. Switch over to Goron Mask. got one left. Fastest way up I can find right now is still blue. I'm a little tick off. ticked off that I fell there. I let go of the button. I don't know how you can lose all of your momentum just by opening up the ball that you're in. I would lose some, but not quite like that. I need to get this show on the road if I want to... I want to check out the things in Goron Village. I mean, come on. This is crazy taking forever. This is why I don't collect fairies and stuff in other games, y'all. I don't... It's not like a thing that just like... Oh, well, I'm already here. I might as well collect it. Like it seems to be for other people. Alright, I'm going to go ahead and go in this way. Wear my fairy mask. And go up. Switch over to Goron. Come on. Switch over to not go on. And there is a fairy in here as well. Let's go ahead and kill these guys. Almost done with these guys. One left. Two left. One left. That's all of you. So, <laughs> from what we've learned in here, apparently, if you can see through something, then you, and you can wear the fairy mask while you're doing it, then you should just shoot through it. That is so dumb. Like, you are so dumb. You should be able to see it. Why can't I see you with the lens of truth on? Why are you not coming here? Get over here. All the stray fairies. So, gonna have to just teleport on out of here. And I don't know what she gives me this time. I've never gotten these before, and I haven't looked up to see what you get. Yeah, sort of my entrance.
Um, I'm thinking about um, resetting the three days and fighting the boss so that I'll have all the three days to check out Goron Village. I guess I have the whole third day. It's like the second day in the middle of the night right now. Rolling. So. Parte. Pull out my sword so I have my swords out during this. All of them, I'm a man. I collected all the fairies. That's what men do. Green fairy lady. With all the pokiness. Dun. Oh, wise young one, I'm the great fairy of wisdom. Uh, I am the freaking... Okay, I'm not really wisdom, I'm courage, but whatever. Thank you for turning my broken, shattered body to normal. Thanks, I shall enhance your magic power. What's that even mean? Does that mean it's bigger? Oh gosh, it's like taking up the whole screen. I mean, look at the size of that magic bar. Like, that's insanity. Magic power has been enhanced. You now have twice as much magical power. Come see me wherever you, whenever you are overcome with weariness. All right. So, stray fairies complete. It only took me. Oh, it only took like s ten minutes to go back in there and get those other two stray fairies. That is pretty good. I guess I was missing out before. So, Snowhead Mountain Village. I've got you now! I don't know why I said that. It seemed like it was about right. I kind of forgot that I was recording. Alrighty. Check out this Mountain Village place. It's so peaceful now. I'm going to go switch over to being a Goron. I wish I had the time to go get all those frogs. But I'm guessing that there's other frogs in places we haven't been yet. Was this place open before? Like, I don't remember. Oh! Oh, that's how Goron's got up here before. Oh, gosh. I could just curl and pound. That was amazing. So this is how Gorons used to get up here. <gasps> There's a hole. Drop. Dun dun dun. I like how they just kind of like look like a throne or something around it. Red rupee, man. Y'all are just wasting my time. I'm looking for heart pieces, dang you. I just have one more and I'll have eight heart containers. It'll be awesome. Alright, let's see if this guy has anything to say about us saving his village. Oh, I guess this soul is at rest now. I don't even know. Techniques. I know your techniques, son. Let's check out the lens of truth around here, see if I'm missing anything. Alrighty. This is cool enough, I'll just go down it. Little lint traps down there. Alrighty. Is this Snow Peak? Or is that just back to the field? Goron Village. This is what I want. Is that water? Oh man, there's a treasure chest down there. I need to learn how to swim better, dang it. My swimming capabilities are terrible. 
As a Goron, they actually don't exist. But as a non-Goron, still only like three meters. See, now I can go down here. No need to waste things. Oh, it's just a hot spring? How disappointing. Let's go ahead and blow this place up. There you are, treasure chest, which I'm sure has like 20 rupees in it. Oh my gosh, I'll kill all of you. Die, die, die. Quit giving me rupees. Should have gone to... To Castle Town or whatever that place is called. Should have gone to the town. Die, die, die. Don't fall in there. It'll respawn. This place is quite beautiful whenever you take away all of the ice and stuff. It should be open since there's no... Since there are no... There's no cold. The reason they closed it before, they said that they closed it because of the... Well, what do you call it? Spring sale. No visiting. Just flowers and stuff. Flowers and potion. Why would I want flowers and potion? I want some... Oh, crap. What do you call it? I lost it. Whoa, screen was messing up there because of the whole day changing thing. It's getting ready to be night, dawn of the first day. Yeah, look at that. I think the old man's gonna be back with his son now. So they should all be super happy. I just feel bad because I'm their dead friend. Note to self, if any one of your dead friends comes back, he's probably a superhero trying to save the world. Tomani, Goron Elder is waiting impatiently for you. They all say the same thing. Tomani, I've been waiting impatiently for you. <laughs> I've been waiting for your arrival ever since I heard the news. I heard that you, the who one whom I once thought to be dead, had sealed off the blizzard that was blowing in from Snowhead. Thanks to you, Spring has come to Goron Village and everyone is pleased. Greatest Goron hero of all, that's... Darmani, the immortal Goron who's not dead, even if he was dead, even if he has died, that's Darmani, star whom we wish upon, that's Darmani, the greatest of Gorons, greatest of Gorons, greatest in the world. Sun got better immediately, he went to see the Goron races that celebrate spring. This time I, the protector of this tribe for so many years, choose to yield the seat of tribal patriarch to a younger one. Goron who makes a calm decision, yet boasts courageous determination can take care of all this to be the patriarch. Chosen one Darmani is you. There could be no other. What do you think? If it's you, everyone would be happily accept you as the patriarch. What? You need not answer so quickly. Go into the Goron race. Think over it slowly. I'm waiting on a thoughtful response. Dude, I cannot be the Goron leader. I'm not even a Goron. Where are the Goron races held? I'm gonna go check out that place over there. Dawn of the final day. I generally don't make it to dawn of the final day. It's kind of crazy. She'll usually have reset by now. Alrighty. So what am I looking for? That's that place down there I was looking for. 
Yay. This guy teaches me how to use powder kegs. I can't climb as anything except for Link. Makes no sense. What is up there? Alrighty, punch this thing. I like how they have more than one huge Goron. The Goron is held to powder keg, the most famous product of the Gorons. Want a powder keg? They explode powerful blasts and are very dangerous. Until I've tested to see if you can use them properly, I can't let you use it. We give it a try, Hexia. Boulder that blocks the entrance to the Goron racetrack? Then I'll prove you to carry them. So, carry it, and then I'll prove you to carry it. It's taking faster, it means that it's about to explode. Try to blow up the boulder near the Goron racetrack or power keg. There's a sign near the racetrack, so keep an eye for it then. Oh. These things are huge. Note to self. I don't know if I can make it there right now. <laughs> Not off to a very good start. Run, 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 run. I don't think a, anyone but a Goron can carry this thing, but we'll see. So, I know where the big thing's at. There's like a place exactly like the one that we just came from right next to it. Like the levels thing that I'll have to throw it and throw it and throw it. When it starts ticking louder, it's almost blowing up. I know we can buy these from... We can buy these from Clock Town. There's the Goron racetrack. But I don't know if there's some big thing we're actually supposed to blow up near there, if it's just something that they put there for fun. You never know with these people. Oh, that was close. It hasn't started ticking too much faster. So I think we're good for now. Ah, what happened? Go on up, we're almost there. Throwing, throwing, throwing. Oh, it so made it. Let's talk to this guy. Darmy, now that it's nice and warm out, it's much, much better. Even my daddy isn't right beside me. I won't be selfish and cry. Even if my daddy isn't right beside me. So now that spring has come, the Garn races should be starting soon. But the rock's in the way, so I can't get to see the race. And spring's just started, too. I was so excited, but there's nothing I can do. I hate it. I want to see it. Uh hate crying Goron. I want to see the explosion, even if it means getting hurt a little bit. Watching an explosion. I know good, cool guys don't look at explosions, but I'm not cool. Way to go, Darmy. That was cool. See, I told you it was cool. Come if we don't hurry, the race will start. Come on, hurry. Alright, I'm not sure if I only have one chance to do this race. <laughs> I sure hope not. That would make me so ticked. But I do have an extended magic bar. Last time I remember losing a bunch because my magic bar was low. We've been waiting. Everyone's asking because they can't wait to enter. You're going to enter, aren't you? Hex, yeah. You have to. I want to show everyone how Darmy races. If your magic runs low, green jars. Oh, wow. We're starting now. I was going to talk to those people. Nobody else turns into spikes like me, though. And I don't think anyone else is as fast as me, either. Oh, well, maybe they are. <laughs> Let's do this. Green jars. Now, I don't think that they steal any of the magic. Like, if they break the stuff, it's just laying out there. I have to win this race. Now, I don't know if jumps make you go faster or slower. Obviously, don't hit the trees. Dang it. Spoke too soon. Dang it, that guy's way up ahead. Why am I so slow? 
Catch up, Darmani. Catch up, you can do it. I guess I do take the magic potion when I break the bottles. I have tons of magic potion. I'm just expecting to see a Tuscan Raider, like, up there, shooting me. <laughs> but everybody knows the Tuscan Raiders have really bad shots. Oh, I got second! No! No, no, no! You're just a little stiff because you waited so long. You're not really like this. Remember how good you are? You're gonna enter. Hex, yeah, I'm gonna enter. Oh. Why was I so ticked off last time whenever I lost when I was a kid? If I could just redo it. And I just really not like redoing things. Like, this is an easy racetrack comparatively. To lots of... Compared to lots of games. Dang it. Y'all keep hitting me. Don't you know I'm Darmani? Die, die, die. So had I not hit that tree, would I have won? Or did I catch up to people because I was in the back? I know that lots of racetrack games make the people in the back go slower. Dang gum, I just got hit by a ton of Gorons. Come on! Gotta catch up. Going, going, going. Dang it! I keep getting nailed by these Gorons. I really feel like there should be a jump in this place. Ah! Can you hear me, Darmy? Sorry, but there's no way you got him in now. Do you want to keep racing? Of course not. Alright. I got it this time. Hex, yeah, I'm gonna enter. Okay, now don't get hit by the Gorons. They all hit me. Like, seriously. Like, that is not me. They're terrible drivers. I'm trying to dodge like crap to get out of the way of them. Never realized that Gorons were this fast. Now, managed to get here without being knocked out by a ton of. Uh, Goron surrounding me. Got it, got it, got it, got it. Go, go, go. Oh, you guys are such bad sports. I'm gonna kick all of y'all's butts. If I could just manage not to fall off of this bridge. See, now I'm catching up. Before, when I was in the lead, they all caught up to me. Now that they're in the lead, I'm catching up to them. It makes no sense. I hate how race games do that. I know they do it so that you're never really out of the lead, but it's so annoying. And die, 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 die. I don't know if I got first there. <laughs> ah, I didn't get it. Oh, I've got this. Got seven minutes to beat this <laughs> for the end of this. Let's do this. Two, one. Oh man. Everyone's got to restart because of me. I jumped the shark. Doesn't really matter because they're all faster than me to begin with anyways. Alright, now. Got to avoid the fray here. Go on the inside. Now remember last time I went at 107. So if I go less than 107. Then I'm going to be kind of ticked. Or if I go faster than, slower than 107 and win, I'm going to be ticked off. Like, I'm sure they just have a standard AI racing thing in here. Oh my gosh! Why am I not speeding up? Go! Oh, this is retarded. I'm getting my butt kicked in this thing. Yeah, faster than 107. Definitely not this time, son. Look at that guy, he's already up there. But, look at the first guy, he went all the way up to 1, 
took him to 112. And 107, I didn't beat him last time. All right. I got this. Come on, racing. I don't even know if I need any magic power or if magic power slows me down. Go, go, go. Go, go, Power Rangers. Alright, now go along the inside. There's less people over there. No, I'm way ahead of everybody right now. There's no reason they should catch up to me. I'm better at dodging all them trees. Way, way ahead. Nobody should get anywhere near catching up to me. But they do. Yet they do. Alright. Now this last part is the part where I always go faster than everyone just because they're usually ahead of me. So let's see if they go faster than me because I'm ahead of them. Remember, 107 is the time to beat. Last time I got 107, I almost won. Oh my gosh. I didn't even get anywhere near 107. I didn't hit anybody. Oh, that was ridiculous. All right. I think jumping makes you go slower or faster. So I'm going to try jumping the whole time. Every single jump is mine. Man, I don't want to lose this race again. I mean, seriously, I kicked butt that time. I was ahead the whole time. Maybe that was my problem. Can't be ahead the whole time. Unless you kind of get hit by, like, that bullet thing that they have in Mario. Oh, gosh, yeah, jumping can't be faster. Has to be slower, right? Man, that guy got blown up. Okay. This one. Oh my gosh, that dude just hit me and knocked out all of my stuff. No idea why. No explanation whatsoever. Like, why did my spikes just disappear when he hit me? Is there a specific place you can touch a Goron to make his spikes disappear? It's a good thing that none of the bad guys know about this place, or else I'd be screwed as a Goron. Oh, <laughs> I won. Cheating is great. <laughs> that was great. I knew you were the fastest. I was sure you'd get first place. This is from Daddy. It's the prize. Ah, oh, it's gold dust. I want to be just like you. Quick. Now, you can use the gold dust to sharpen your sword, and if you sharpen your sword, he'll get it ready to you by the morning. The big problem here... Oh yeah, and I also got myself a second bottle! The big problem being that I um, don't have until morning because this is the dawn of the final day. So, what I'm going to be doing is sharpening my sword. Alright, turn away from being Goron. <laughs> ah, customer. Why you ask? Because tomorrow's the carnival and you can't work during the carnival, can you? See, you can't do anything. So, what I need to do is go back, and it's what I'm going to do off screen, actually. Is go over to... Uh, the first day, beat the boss. And uh, after I beat the boss, I will... After I beat the boss, what I'm going to do is um, come back here, race it, and then I'll come back while I, to where I was at, which is... Um, Um, to sharpen my sword, so I'll show you guys all of that stuff. But I'm just going to start up right next to that building.
uh, getting ready to sharpen my sword. You guys don't need to rewatch me race a million times or anything like that. Now what I need to do is go to this guy. And get myself a powder keg. Or just talk to him about it. <laughs> um, so that he'll give me that license. I don't know if... I don't know if he gave you the license already because you know how or anything like that. Looks like I managed... You managed to succeed knowing your skills. I feel fine letting you handle the powder kegs on your own. It was bad of me to put you through such a dangerous test. I want you to take this as my apology. You got a powder keg. See the light. Powder kegs are very volatile, so you can carry only one at a time. If you shoot them with an arrow, they'll explode as soon as they're hit, so be careful. So what you're telling me is that I didn't need to, like, carry it around, like, for an hour like you made me do? You are a crazy man. If that thing had blown up in my hands and died, and Darmani, the leader, the one that you thought was like the best thing ever, who just saved your entire village, had died, what would you have done? Would you have just been fine with that? Like that's insanity. You don't give somebody a loaded keg unless that's the only way they can carry it. I mean, look at this. Okay, so now I have a place for the powder keg, I have my second bottle um, this is kind of awesome now all right come back to me with your decision after you've entered the Gorn race and thought about it carefully I have my son should be anxiously awaiting a revival now quickly go beyond the Twin Islands cave after leaving Goron village Twin Island cave after re leaving Goron village I don't know where that is So, Song of Soaring. We're going to start looking for that cave. I'm going to guess it's blocked by a big old boulder. Um, I'm going to go to Clock Town. Deposit my rupees. And kick General Butt. Alright, actually, it's time, so I am going to go ahead and finish this episode. Um, thank you guys for watching. We kicked some serious butt this time, raced, got powder kegs. Um, when you come back, I'll be looking for Twin Islands uh, Cave. And uh, yeah, thanks for coming. Um, if you enjoy this video, check out, there will be more every single day, and uh, subscribe, I'll be putting up some every single day, as I said already, so, alright, until next time, I'll see you.